Imagine a colossal, invisible frontier, an unseen barrier stretching across the vastness of space, marking the very edge of everything we know. This is the line that separates our solar system from the immense mysterious galaxy beyond, a boundary between the familiar and the unknown. For decades astronomers and dreamers alike could only speculate about what might exist at this distant edge. Now for the first time, we have answers. Billions of kilometers from the warmth of the sun, the legendary Voyager spacecraft have encountered what scientists call a wall of fire. This is not the stuff of science fiction or fantasy. In June 2025, after years of careful analysis, scientists announced a discovery that fundamentally reshapes our understanding of the solar system and our place within the cosmos. This boundary, known as the heliopause, acts as a protective shield, enveloping our solar system and making life on Earth possible by blocking deadly high-energy cosmic rays from deep space. Voyager's instruments revealed a superheated plasma wall, with temperatures soaring to 50,000 Kelvin, hotter even than the surface of our own sun. This invisible wall is a turbulent, energetic frontier. The edge of our solar system is not a quiet, empty void but a place of drama and violence, where solar winds clash with the interstellar medium in a cosmic battle. The journey to this astonishing revelation began nearly 50 years ago, when two humble probes were launched on an audacious mission to explore the unknown. Voyager 1 and 2 have traveled farther than any other human-made object in history, carrying with them the sights, sounds and greetings of Earth on a golden record, a message to the stars. Their continued operation, decades after launch, is a testament to human ingenuity, perseverance, and our unyielding desire to explore the universe beyond our home. The discovery of this wall of fire is a moment of profound wonder, a reminder to look up, to marvel at the mysteries that surround us, and to appreciate the magnificent sometimes terrifying universe we inhabit. It inspires us to keep pushing the boundaries of what is known, to continue our journey into the great cosmic ocean, and to never stop seeking answers among the stars. The Voyager missions began with a rare planetary alignment, an event so unique that it only occurs once every 176 years, offering a fleeting window for exploration. This grand tour opportunity allowed a single spacecraft to visit multiple outer planets by using their gravity to slingshot from one to the next, a feat never before attempted. In 1977, NASA seized this chance and launched Voyager 2, followed closely by Voyager 1, with the bold goal of exploring the mysterious giant planets that had long captured human imagination. Before Voyager, these distant worlds were little more than blurry, indistinct disks in our telescopes, enigmatic, and largely unknown. The Voyager probes became our remote eyes and ears, equipped with sophisticated instruments to gather unprecedented data on planetary atmospheres, magnetic fields, moons and rings. Voyager 1 unveiled Jupiter's swirling storms and the explosive volcanic activity on its moon Io, then revealed the intricate beauty of Saturn's rings in stunning detail. Voyager 2 continued the odyssey, becoming the only spacecraft ever to visit the ice giants Uranus and Neptune, sending back breathtaking images and data. These encounters revolutionized our understanding of the outer planets, transforming them from distant mysteries into dynamic, complex worlds. After their historic planetary flybys, the mission's focus shifted. The Voyager interstellar mission was born, extending humanity's reach even farther. The probe set out to explore the very edge of the sun's influence, venturing into the uncharted territory beyond the known planets destined to leave the solar system entirely. They became our first scouts to cross the final frontier, measuring the boundary where the solar wind gives way to the vastness of the galaxy. This ambitious extension led to the extraordinary discovery of a turbulent, fiery boundary at the threshold of interstellar space, a region never before explored. Voyager's journey stands as a testament to human curiosity, ingenuity, and the courage to seize rare opportunities and venture boldly into the unknown. The Voyager probes are marvels of 1970s engineering, built to endure the harshest conditions of deep space. Each carries a large high-gain antenna, their lifeline to Earth across billions of kilometers. Power comes from radioisotope thermoelectric generators using plutonium-238 to produce electricity where sunlight is too faint. Careful power management has kept them alive far beyond their original design life. Each probe is equipped with cameras, spectrometers, magnetometers, and crucially, plasma and cosmic ray detectors. These instruments let Voyager sense the environment, detect the solar wind, and cross into interstellar space. 
Affixed to each is the golden record, a message in a bottle carrying the sights and sounds of Earth for any who might find it. Voyager's mission is both scientific and symbolic, a declaration that we were here, and we were curious. To truly grasp the significance of the Wall of Fire discovery, we first need to understand what the heliopause is, and why it matters so much in the story of our solar system. The sun is constantly sending out the solar wind, a powerful stream of charged particles that races outward in all directions. This wind doesn't just fade away, it actually forms a gigantic protective bubble around our solar system, known as the heliosphere. This bubble acts as a shield, protecting us from high-energy cosmic rays and other dangerous particles that come from deep space, far beyond our sun's influence. The heliopause marks the very edge of this bubble. It's the place where the outward push of the solar wind is finally balanced and stopped by the pressure of the interstellar medium, the thin gas and dust that fills the space between stars. In a historic achievement, Voyager 1 crossed this invisible boundary in 2012, followed by Voyager 2 in 2018. Their journeys confirm that the heliopause is a real distinct frontier, not just a theoretical line. At the heart of this story is plasma, the mysterious fourth state of matter. Plasma is a superheated electrically charged soup of particles found not only in stars but also in lightning auroras in the space between planets. It's highly responsive to magnetic fields, making it crucial to the dynamics at the edge of our solar system. The sun's magnetic field carried outward by the solar wind collides and interacts with the galactic magnetic field at the heliopause. This interaction shapes the boundary, creating a dramatic and ever-changing frontier. The so-called wall of fire isn't a solid barrier but a region where plasma temperatures soar to an astonishing 30,000 to 50,000 Kelvin, hotter than almost anywhere else in the solar system. Yet, despite these extreme temperatures the plasma here is so incredibly diffuse, spread out over vast distances, that Voyager was able to pass through it unharmed, continuing its journey into interstellar space. This region is even hotter than the surface of the Sun itself, a testament to the truly extreme and unexpected conditions that exist at the very edge of our solar system. The discovery of this fiery boundary redefines our understanding of where the solar system ends and interstellar space begins. It's a powerful reminder that the cosmos is far more dynamic, violent and surprising than we once believed, with boundaries that are constantly shifting and evolving. Thanks to Voyager's daring crossing, what was once just a theory has now become a proven reality, opening a new chapter in our exploration of the universe. The confirmation of this fiery boundary was a scientific triumph announced in June 2025. Voyager 1's plasma instrument failed decades ago so scientists waited for Voyager 2's fully functional sensors to reach the heliopause. In November 2018, Voyager 2 detected a sharp drop in solar wind and a spike in galactic cosmic rays, clear signs it had left the Sun's domain. The plasma data revealed a region far hotter and denser than expected, the first direct evidence of the wall of fire. Scientists believe magnetic reconnection, where magnetic fields break and rejoin, superheats the plasma at this boundary. Voyager 2, nearly 21 billion kilometers from Earth, sent back this discovery with just 4 watts of power. This data fundamentally changes our model of the solar system's edge. NASA scientists are now building a three-dimensional picture of this dynamic, fiery barrier. Voyager's achievement is a triumph of persistence and ingenuity. The Wall of Fire discovery has profound implications for space weather and our solar system's protection. The heliosphere is our shield against galactic cosmic rays, and the superheated plasma wall may play a crucial role in filtering them. This finding forces us to rethink models of stellar systems across the galaxy. Each star likely has its own version of a heliosphere. Understanding these boundaries is vital as we search for habitable exoplanets and plan future interstellar missions. Voyager 2's data provides the first direct measurements of what a spacecraft would face leaving a star system. This is invaluable engineering data for future explorers. The universe is always more complex and surprising than we imagine. Voyager's lesson, there's no substitute for direct exploration. While the Wall of Fire made headlines, Voyager's data archive continues to yield discoveries. In 2024, scientists solved a 38-year-old mystery about Uranus, using Voyager 2's 1986 flyby data. The probe found Uranus's magnetosphere nearly empty of plasma but with intense radiation belts, a contradiction. Modern analysis revealed Voyager 2 arrived just after a rare solar wind event compressed Uranus's magnetosphere, creating a temporary anomaly. This means Uranus's moons could be geologically active, 
contributing particles to the magnetosphere. The findings reshape our view of Uranus as a dynamic system. With a flagship mission to Uranus now a top NASA priority, Voyager's data is more valuable than ever. The archive continues to guide future exploration. Voyager's legacy, new insights decades after the data was first collected. Experts like Matt Schindel of the Smithsonian stress the unique irreplaceable nature of the Voyager program. The probes evolved from planetary explorers to interstellar scouts, and their data remains the best we have for Uranus and Neptune. NASA engineers' ingenuity has kept the spacecraft operational for nearly 50 years. Each new piece of data refines our models of the galaxy and our solar system's place within it. The wall of fire shows the solar system's boundary is an active, energetic furnace, not a passive curtain. Voyager represents humanity at its best, curious, persistent, and united in exploration. The data is a shared inheritance, a grand adventure expanding our horizons. The Voyager saga is one of humanity's greatest epics. Their discovery of a wall of fire at the heliopause reveals our solar system's boundary as a dynamic, violent region. This finding alters our understanding of our home's protective bubble and its interaction with the galaxy. Voyager's legacy extends beyond this discovery. Its data archive continues to guide new missions and solve old mysteries. The golden records carry our message into the void, a symbol of curiosity and hope. The most important lesson, stay curious, keep exploring and embrace the unknown. The adventure is far from over, 